Hi, my name is Alex. I'm a librarian at the University of Alabama, and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to use CINAHL Plus with full text. CINAHL Plus is one of the best databases we have for students in the fields of nursing and public health. It's a great place for researchers in those fields to find academic journal articles, clinical trials, systematic reviews, and more. First off, to use CINAHL Plus, you'll need to go to the university library's website. Once there, just click on the Databases link. Once you're on the Databases page, you can just type CINAHL into the search box. CINAHL starts you out on their advanced search page. You'll see that you have multiple search bars here to combine search terms. Now in another tutorial I'm going to talk about some more advanced ways of searching, but for now let's just start out with something kind of simple. In this case I'm looking for academic journal articles about how nutrition can help to manage some of the symptoms associated with autism. So I can start by simply looking for autism and nutrition. I don't even really need to include the search term symptoms in this case. CINAHL Plus should just kind of know what I'm looking for. And here's what we find. 88 sources about the topic. The first one, Managing Autism Symptoms Through Nutrition, looks promising. But first let's talk about a few basic things you can do to make your search more specific. On the left hand side of the screen, CINAHL gives you the option to customize your search. For example, you can look for articles published within a certain time frame. This is especially helpful for researchers using CINAHL as students of nursing and public health usually won't want to rely on older sources. So let's just change the date from 1993 to 2010, click enter. And now we only have sources from the last four to five years. I said before that I was looking specifically for academic journal articles. And one way to make sure of that is to click on this academic journal limiter. So now all we're finding is academic journal articles published since 2010. So let's look at this first article that we found. Click on the link and you're taken to this page where you'll find a good bit of information about the article. You'll see the author of the article, the journal it came from, and you'll usually see an abstract which is just a summary of the article. In this case there is no abstract. Finally on the left hand side of the screen you'll see the PDF full text link. Just click on the link and you have the article. You can save it, print it, or email it to yourself. And that's all for this tutorial. You should now have a good idea of how to get started using CINAHL Plus with full text. Check out our other tutorial if you want to learn about some more advanced search tips. And remember, if you ever have any questions, ask a librarian.